Human papillomavirus, aka HPV, is the most common newly diagnosed STD in the U.S. It is said that HPV was recognized during the time of ancient Greece and Rome. It wasn't until the 1970s that researchers identified HPV and connected it to genital warts and cancers. It is transmitted during vaginal, anal, or oral sex. It's passed on when there is genital to genital contact. It can be passed on between both straight and same-sex partners. The symptoms for both men and women are not always seen, but sometimes infected people get genital warts, which look like small bumps seen in the genital area, mouth, and throats. A person can have HPV for years and not even know it. HPV can stay in one's body for approximately two years and usually does not appear in cycles and does not normally last forever. The long-term effects are cervical cancer and many other cancers. Both men and women get infected by this disease. Most infections occur in people when they are in their early teens and 20s. As they grow older, their chances of becoming infected lessen. About 15% of people between the ages of 15 and 49 in the U.S. have HPV. Approximately 40% of sexually active teenage girls become infected with HPV at some time in their life and most do not show symptoms. There are no cures for HPV, but the disease usually clears on its own. There are many ways to prevent HPV, which include vaccines, condoms, trustworthy sexual partner, and sexual abstinence. Some of us may have already been protected from HPV, and we might not even know it. Vaccines protect both males and females against HPV. The vaccines are given in three shots, and it's important to get the three doses to get the best protection. Gardasil is a popular vaccine, often given at 11 or 12 years old.